Hi everybody, this is Juhi and uh, what I have for you guys today is um, something that has to do with what do you like and in this I have um, what do you like and this is something that has to do with pictures of different objects and then you ask questions to the child about it so again we're going to be talking about language we're going to be encouraging language so for example there is a picture of a snake and then you're asking questions tell me the name of the reptile you like what do you like about it is there anything you don't like about it tell me the name of a type of weather you like what do you like about it is there anything you don't like about it so basically you're bringing about something for the child and then what you're doing is that you are asking questions about that particular item or activity um, and then you're just brainstorming with the child right and then tell me the name of a candy you like what do you like about it is there anything you don't like about it tell me the name of the puzzle you like what do you like about it is there anything you don't like about it Tell me the name of a vegetable you like. What do you like about it? Is there anything you don't like about it? Tell me the name of a board game you like. What do you like about it? Is there anything you don't like about it? Tell me the name of a chewing gum you like. What do you like about it? Is there anything you don't like about it? Tell me the name of a sea animal you like. What do you like about it? Is there anything you don't like about it? Tell me the name of a toy you like. What do you like about it? What do you not like about it? Tell me the name of a pet you like. What do you like about it? Is there anything you don't like about it? Tell me the name of a wild animal you like. What do you like about it? And is there anything you don't like about it? Mm, yummy, yummy. Tell me the name of a cookie you like. What do you like about it? And what do you not like about it? Tell me the name of a color you like. What do you like about it? What do you not like about it? Tell me the name of pizza you like. What do you like about it? And what do you not like about it? Tell me the name of a letter you like. What do you like about it? What do you not like about it? Tell me the name of a drink you like. What do you like about it? What do you not like about it? Tell me the name of a stuffed animal you like. What do you like about it? And what do you not like about it? In the same manner, there are 52 cards in this series and they all have different pictures in it. And you can go over them like this one, tell me the name of your favorite insect, what do you like about it, what, what do you not like about it. And then this one has horses on it, so it says, tell me the name of your favorite farm animal you like, what do you like about it, what do you not like about it. Tell me the name of a costume you like, what do you like about it. What do you not like about it? Tell me the name of the favorite video game you like. What do you like about it? What do you not like about it? And in the same manner, you keep on going forward. And there are 52 picture cards in this series. And so you keep on going. So tell me the name of the museum you like. What do you like about it? What do you not like about it? Tell me the name of an ice cream flavor you like. What do you like about it? What do you not like about it? Tell me the name of the favorite fruit you like. What do you like about it? What do you not like about it? Tell me the name of the favorite flower you like. What do you like about it? What do you not like about it? Ooh, I like this one. Tell me the name of a bird you like. What do you like about it? What do you not like about it? and then we keep on going there are 52 cards in here 
and you talk about all of them. Tell me the name of the favorite snack you like. What do you like about it? And what do you not like about it? So the best thing about these cards is that they are language builders, language starters. Um, and once you start working with these cards, you are able to build the language of the child. And once you build the language of the child, that is really cool because now you're starting a conversation and the child is able to conversate with you and able to answer your questions. So I really like these cards. Here's the thing. The only thing is that you need pictures. Once you have the pictures, you don't really need to actually like buy them, buy them. You can have pictures from the internet, from Google. Um, you can print them out and you just have to know you just need to know the questions to ask the child once you know the questions to ask the child you can bring out all these pictures and you can start asking those questions to the kids or the adults that you are working with and these are language builders they are conversation starters so you can start a conversation with the child you can start all those initiations with the child so have fun with language, think outside the box, give your kids ample opportunity to indulge in language. I hope that this video was helpful for you guys. Have a wonderful day, stay safe and stay healthy.